Hello YouTube friends. This is Richard Maybe with Richard Maybe Presents. Um, got an interesting show planned for today. And uh, I was going through my comic book collection. And I haven't uh, looked at this book in a good two, maybe three years. And it's the top, the 1984 Topper book. I have another one and I was looking for it to you know include in this show but I wasn't able to find it in my collection so it might be in with my mad magazines or, or, or with my regular books I'm packing everything up so this is the topper book it's uh, printed in England and uh, here it is, the topper, and I'll focus in here. Let's see, get it good here. There it goes. London, and uh, published by D.C. Thompson and Company, London, at 185 Fleet Street. Uh, I love these books. The colors are very rich, bright. Uh, they must use. They use. A, they use a very. Um, there's a word for this type of paper. It's a very thick paper. Um, I've got a research on the internet. And there's a name for this type of paper. Um, oh, this is cool. You know, you get to put in your name and your address and uh, that kind of thing. Um, this was given to me as a gift from a friend. And I always look for these. T I go to comic book shows at least once every two months and I always look for these topper books they're hardcover they're hardcover and they're really hard to find really really hard to find but here's a <laughs> just the first story there we go you can see how bright the colors are the yellows and the blues this uh, chapter is called Tricky Dicky the world's greatest trickster and that goes on for a while. And then you got to Ali's Baba. They're just really offbeat little stories. <laughs> they're sort of they're cute. Uh, let me get to... <laughs> I like this one. Adam's Ancestors. Everyday things were a lot different for the boys of Adam Appleby's family tree. So... It's this uh, boy's every uh, issue or every book. They have another Adam's ancestors. You can see the richness of the color. You know, they had that, uh, the way they do the shadowing like here, you know, just really good artwork. Um, this is kind of off the, Beaten path. Burl the Pearl. <laughs> Just <laughs> British, offbeat British humor, you know. It's really great. Um, Al Change, Master of Disguise. I guess this fellow goes in for goes in for different disguises. Great, great stuff. I have another one. I'm, I'm, I'm determined. Here we go. Uh, Tom and Terry. These two boys, I don't know if they're, I think they're brothers. Or no, brother and sister. Okay, here you go. Tom and Terry. There it is there. You can see the richness of the blue in the background and the red. It's just really bright colors. This is uh, Sir Veridan the Valiant. The shortest knight in the kingdom. Oh, crazy, wacky, unique British humor, you know? Superboy, S-O-U-P, boy. <laughs> huh. Great story here, Super, Superboy, S-O-U-P, Superboy. Oh, wow, another, another Adam's Ancestor, number two. I guess they gave you 
give you a few of it. Now here's a classic. You see the way that the artwork is done here? I mean, really well done artwork. The, the, the cross, you know, oh, just really dark colors and really well done. Fred the Flop. This guy's always having one disaster after another. Now I got this. This is the 80, 1984 one. I think the next I had the other one I had was eight nineteen eighty five. I don't know if they stopped. Fearful Fun Tales number one. Now, I don't know if they stopped publishing these. I I, I always this is a good one. Nobby. <laughs> it just 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 funny stuff. I mean. Oh, this, I love this. I remember this. Mickey the Monkey. Kind of almost like the kind of cartoons I remember when I was a kid, like seven, eight, nine years old. And you had um, Snuffy Smith and um, different, different hillbillies and kind of things and crazy stuff. Uh, Danny's tranny he's got a special tranny it makes it makes things temporarily bigger smaller lighter than air or even invisible it's got a, like a, a little bit like uh, the old dc comics dial h for hero you know he is not the superhero but his gizmo is much like dial h for hero from the from the 60s tiny about this, uh, this is a, I guess it's a big dog. They, the world's biggest dog, they named him Tiny. Yep. Uh, be right back. Back. I just got a phone call from this very nice company, health insurance company, and they, they wanted to sell me some health insurance. It's so nice of them. Just so wonderful. Oh, Adam's ancestor number three. But, uh, and on and on it goes. Uh, um, this, <laughs> this, <laughs> how, how the topper book is made. <laughs> they take the crazy how the book is made. <laughs> Just this here it is, the 1984 topper book. That's the front, and that's the back. If you know, because I look on internet auctions, I go to. Comic book auctions, I cannot find topper books. If you know where to buy topper books at a reasonable price, you know, please let me know in the comments section. Okay, Scout Patch of the Day from 1984, the Booten District, 1984, show and do, fall campery. I've got it wrapped up in uh, cellophane here to keep it nice. Uh, Jack Floyd designed this patch. He really did a nice job on this. Different, different events that they had at this show and do. Uh, canoeing, camping, uh, some kind of pyramid making, you know, nature, singling, and cooking. Patch of the day and photo of the day. <laughs> this is from when I was three years old. And on the back it says, Richard Maybe, with in a pencil with my old handwriting when I was in fourth grade. And Mrs. Jacob Schick had this on the, on the, on the big uh, board, current events board. She didn't put any current events that, that week. But you brought in a picture of you when you were little. And then we played this fun game. You had to guess, you know, put a number underneath each picture and you had to guess who was who. So this is from, I, I think I was about, I think I was about three years old there. And the, what really breaks my heart is there's a little chip there from the picture. And it really breaks my heart. And I'll tell you, good old days. Ah. So at any rate, I'm going to wrap things up. 
And I, I just wanted to have a light and breezy little show. I love these topper books. Just wanted to share them with my viewing audience, with my friends, and have a little fun. So, as always, oh, I always forget. Please hit the like button. Helps me with the uh, big wheels at uh, YouTube. And also, if you don't, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button. We appreciate it. As always, stay strong, stay happy, stay stay safe. This is Richard Maybe signing off.